Good afternoon. It is my great honor to represent Habitat for Humanity at today's event and to join in the recognition of my friend and colleague, Blake Strayhorn, whom you'll meet in just a second. Blake, you will see, is a man of great humility, but with an unbridled passion for helping others. You'll also see in just a moment a video uh, of some of the work that Blake's Habitat affiliate, Habitat for Humanity of Durham, is doing, and uh, some photos. And I know that you will be as inspired by this interfaith work as I am. To help put the work of Habitat Durham in context, I'd like to take a moment to tell you a little bit about Habitat, our history, our work, and most importantly, our foundational commitment as a Christian faith-based organization to work arm in arm with people of other faiths. At Habitat, we like to say that God is our center, but not our boundary. Our staff, our volunteers, and most importantly, the families who we serve are of all faiths or no faith at all. What's important to us is the ability to serve others. Habitat's vision is very simple. We pursue a world where everyone has a decent place to live. Last year, Habitat helped more than 8 million people all around the world to build or improve a place to call home. But we come from very humble beginnings. Habitat was founded in 1976 in a small town in southwest Georgia. The founders of Habitat weren't affordable housing experts. They were a small group of faithful Christian men and women looking for a way to put their faith into action. They chose shelter as their focus. Throughout our 43-year history, Habitat has remained true to our commitment to shelter and true to our identity as a faith-based organization. Today, Habitat works in nearly 70 countries all around the world, including predominantly Muslim countries such as Bangladesh and Indonesia. We have had great success in working with local religious and government leaders in those countries. We have found that our message of being an inclusive Christian organization has always been welcomed by local leaders of all faiths. Our remarkable Habitat for Humanity of Durham, North Carolina is one of more than 1,200 Habitat affiliates in the United States. Habitat's niche has always been and remains home ownership. We believe in the potential of home ownership to change the trajectory of a family, to open a new world of possibilities. Our families are low income, but for Habitat, these families would likely never be able to achieve the dream of home ownership. Although we are a Christian organization, Habitat realized many years ago that other faith groups, including the Muslim faith, shared a central theological call to care for those in need. These same groups also hold long traditions of providing shelter as a means to help families move out of poverty. With so many shared commitments, we realized that by joining forces with other faith groups, we could multiply our efforts to truly achieve a world where everyone has a decent place to live. Our interfaith work was formally launched in 2006, following a gathering of leaders from the Christian, Muslim, and Jewish faiths. In the video that you'll see in just a moment, you'll see that our interfaith work goes far, far deeper than simply gathering people together on the work site. The model calls for forging personal relationships and creating an opportunity for volunteers to learn about other faith traditions. In the course of designing our formal national program, we learned, not surprisingly, that many of our local affiliates, including Habitat Durham, were already deeply, deeply engaged in interfaith work in their own communities. We are so proud of this work and the hundreds of families all over the United States who have benefited from it. But we are equally proud of the new relationships, stronger community bonds, and deeper understanding of other faith traditions that have been made possible by this work. 
I know that Blake will talk about this as well, but in today's world, while labels and stereotypes so often divide us, there's something about building a house together that unites us. Habitat builds bring people together from all walks of life, different ages, different income levels, ethnicity, and re religious beliefs. On the build site, we discover and celebrate the things we have in common. Lives change, not just for the families we serve, but for our volunteers. Thank you again for inviting us to be with you today. We are humbled and honored to be with you. And again, on behalf of our entire Habitat for Humanity network all over the world, we offer our congratulations to Blake Strayhorn for his recognition as your 2019 humanitarian and to Habitat for Humanity of Durham for the transformational community work they do every day. Thank you.